are eating rich versus broke food for the next 24 hours, and to figure out who does the rich budget, we're gonna do the last of burp challenge. Last to burp or first to finish win. Three, two, one. Come on, Daniel. Oh, gotta get that rich budget. We are gonna be rich, Daniel. Don't make us broke. Is he gonna burp? Is he gonna burp? Rich team over here. We oh. cannot be broke for this challenge. I don't want broke food. Yeah. Oh, okay. Team Rich is on the way. Yeah. Uh oh, my stomach's settling. I don't want to burp. Oh, man. Maybe I just into a light. No, that's not good. How are you not? <laughs> oh! No! Come on! Oh! oh, look who's gonna be eating broke meals for the next 24 hours. So excited. Well settled, Maddie, Daniel, you guys gonna have a rich bunch. Which means that you guys can only order from five star restaurants for the entire day. I have to order from only one star restaurant. This is the worst review of food! But I saw Phase Rug do this, you did a pretty good job. You're not paying for the rich ones, I'm actually gonna be paying for that. So we'll go ahead and put your credit cards in here and we will swap. Yes, pop, pop your credit, credit card, card in there. Enjoy. <laughs> all right guys, we'll head upstairs. Everything should be all set for you. Enjoy your day of luxury. Oh, I will. <laughs> It feels so good to be rich. So you guys are used to seeing Rebecca here, but this is the Matt Slays channel, so I'm gonna do this challenge on my own. Well, I grew up actually not having a ton of money at all, and we just ate whatever we cooked, so we never really went out to restaurants, so this whole rating system is pretty new to me. Let's go on to Yelp right now and find the worst rated restaurants in our city. You know what, I've never ordered from a five-star restaurant. You know, it's too expensive. I know, right? I mean, I've always thought that I'm a five-star girl, but my bank account can never afford it, oh. so today we are living good. <gasps> Ooh, that oh, looks good. Oh my gosh, you can get a $200 breakfast. Oh, we are definitely ordering this. Eat off of whatever you are sitting on. Well, I was sitting on one of these gold plates. Looks like breakfast is here, so. Oh my gosh, what? Did they pick the challenge yet? We have to eat off of whatever you're sitting on. I'm sitting on the floor right now, so I have to eat this meal off the floor. Are you kidding me right now? This meal actually looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Hey, who forgot the bacon? They didn't get the bacon on the order. Dang it. And you heard what the challenge was. I have to eat whatever I'm sitting on, and I'm sitting on the floor, so. Let's start off with these eggs here. Oh my gosh, they said that these tasted, was it like rubber? Despite it tasting like it's been on the floor, I'm pretty good. It is time to reveal our first course of breakfast. Chocolate chip pancakes. Oh, you got chocolate chip? Oh, yeah. Mine's just normal pancake, but it looks good. Oh, and they are warm to the touch. See how these $100 pancakes taste? Mmm. Mm. It's so good. They like melt in your mouth. Mm -hmm, they're pretty good, but I don't think these were $100 each. These taste more like they'd be like $50 each. They melt in your mouth. They're really good. 50 bucks? I don't know if I'd pay 50 bucks, but oh, no. I'm eating like a king! Look at this. Look at this. Standards king. are pretty low. Eat your chocolate chips. I am eating my chocolate chips. Eat chocolate chips is probably like 25 bucks. You know what, I think it's time for the second course of breakfast. Mm. Okay, they said they were nasty. I'm gonna eat this little sausage right here. It's actually pretty good, and it's been on the floor, so I'm gonna give this restaurant four out of five stars. I don't think they deserve that rating. I think that guy was grumpy. I just hope I don't have to eat off the floor for the rest of the day. That breakfast was so good. It was only $200. Hopefully this next meal will be a little more rich. What? It was $200. $200 breakfast? I never spent that for breakfast. For two? That should be for one. Okay, just chew something out of here. Today. Choose a caffeine snack for the other team. We get to choose for them? Let's get them something super broke. Meal number one was not that bad. I survived off of eating off the floor. That was pretty tasty. I actually found some other things in there. Thank you, whoever was cleaning the, the place too. It's pretty clean here. But I did notice that something was missing. And yeah, I am standing on the cardboard now because I don't want to eat off the ground anymore. There wasn't any coffee. Are, are we getting coffee now? We have to eat whatever the other person's buying. So I have to buy something for them, but they're gonna buy something for me too. Daniel and Maddie are probably having the time of their lives up there. I'm gonna make it really good because I like Maddie and Daniel. I want to really give them a good experience if they're gonna do this right now. So there's a really good coffee shop. The best. The only five-star coffee shop in Los Angeles. It's called Alfred Coffee. So let me just get this. Ooh, this is Daniel's favorite. Daniel loves coffee. Ugh, this one has mushrooms in it, but it's super, super bougie. So I'm gonna get that for me. Perfect. All right, let's find the worst rated coffee. Oh, this one. This 7-Eleven is the worst. I've been there. And Enrique, he does not know how to make good coffee. <laughs> All right, we will get them two yeah. coffees from 7-Eleven. Last time I was there, I gave him one star. I wish you could give him like a quarter of a star. It was so bad. <laughs> well, hope they enjoy their broke coffee. Hope they get us something very expensive. I hope so too. I'm ready for some. <gasps> they're gonna get us good coffee. Did they say what they're getting me? What? 7-Eleven? Daniel, I don't know what you guys are doing up there because Daniel always says that 7-Eleven has the worst coffee out of all the gas stations. Oh my gosh. Maybe there's just, if you get a little deeper in the cup, it's better. 
Oh my gosh. Why would they give me the worst? Oh, I get it. They have to do one star review, but I thought this would not be true. It's like somebody gave a bad review, but this is pretty true. It tastes like dirt mixed with a baby's diaper. Is there a reason why I have like burns going down too? It's got spices or something? What is this? I'm so excited for our caffeine treat. Mm -hmm. Oh, no way. No way. This is from Alfred Coffee. This is like one of the best coffees in Los Angeles. Is it expensive? Yes, very. Giga rich? Yeah, I mean, I think each coffee is at least over like 10 bucks. That's it? 10 bucks? Yeah, this should be at least 10... a $50 coffee. We'll see what yours is. Can you describe it? I have an iced chocachino. Chocachino! What's that? You got the chocachino. This is special. What do you mean? I want you to take a drink first before I tell you why, why it's so special. Take a drink. I'm gonna drink mine. This is their world famous ice latte. This is a five star rated latte. Only one in Los Angeles. It's like this. And let me. I might pass out. It's so good. It doesn't taste that rich. There's not even gold flakes in this. Oh my gosh, Maddie, do you know what you're drinking? Mm. It's a rare mushroom. That coffee is made of mushrooms. The chitter chugga. Isn't or how do they pronounce it? Mushroom? The chitter chugga. The chitter chugga. It's really healthy for you, too. And aren't you into like working out and health? You should be super excited. I, am. I don't know. It tastes <sighs> like it might be only 10 bucks. <sighs> Every time. It tastes so good. Time for some lunch. Let's see what we got here. I'm gonna order up something good. It's not looking that good right now. The one star foods all have terrible reviews. This one looks pretty bad, but I love Salvadorian food. Let me get this fish was actually rated terribly and the pupusas were really bad too. Okay, this one says we need to eat blindfolded. Is there a challenge with this one? Blindfolded. Same fam, I'm not gonna eat blindfolded because I wanna see what I'm eating, but I'll let them do that up there. They just bought me the worst coffee in the world. I'm gonna sit out here, maybe try to take a little nap or something like that. This place, hold on. They just declined the order. Dang it! It's another Salvadorian restaurant. Here we go. Okay, that means that the restaurant was probably pretty bad because they said that the restaurant is closed. Postmates wasn't even able to get a hold of the restaurant. Let me order some fish, some pupusas from this place. I don't know why everybody's hating on the Salvadorians. The food's usually pretty fire. Just getting to a zen spot here, and hopefully Daniel and Maddie are having a better time than I am. That is gonna ruin the meal for me. I mean, if you can't see the presentation, then it's not even Giga Rich meal. No, but what if it's gonna enhance our other senses because we can't see? But what if we can't see the gold on the food? All right. Daniel, where should we order from? Five stars only. Okay, what about that? Dim sum. Ooh, dim sum. That would be good. That sounds giga rich. Okay, you gotta order the most expensive thing. Ooh. That chicken was $500? $500 chicken, I mean it could be more expensive. This is one star rated food. There's a reason why it is. This is probably pretty bad. I mean, this fish looks like it's been sitting there for a little bit. Sometimes they pre-cook these things because you have to cook them for a long time. So this one might have been pre-cooked a couple days. Comment down below. You ever had, oh, yeah. You know what? <coughs> I just choked a little bit. Hold on. It's not that bad. Get some of that rice in there. Get the whole flavor. Woo! It's actually kind of good. I wish I could see what's in front of me right now. Oh, it smells good. It doesn't smell like $500. What does $500 smell like? Smells oh. like some good chicken. Oh, I'm gonna bite this. Oh, it's like cold chicken. Cold? Yeah, maybe it's They served it to you cold? Maybe that's a delicacy. That is not a delicacy. What? Cold chicken? I want the food warm if I'm paying try $500. It? You wanna try it? Sure. Where is it? Here. Okay. There you go. What'd you get? I haven't tried it yet, but it's squishy. This chicken was $500? Mm-hmm. It's not even that good. It tastes like $20 chicken. Ooh, I see another plate. There's something in front of me. Oh, what is this? Mm. Ooh. Mm. Not gonna lie, this is actually pretty good. I don't know mm. if it's giga rich, but it is rich. Mmm, I don't know what I'm eating. What are you eating? I don't know. It's squishy, and it's mm. sour. Man, I cannot believe that we're spending so much money on food today. <laughs> Daniel, we are not spending the money on food, and honestly, I am so glad that I'm not spending the money because I finally have some money on my card. I mean, you know, it declines all the time, but oh, a little yeah. bit of savings in there now. If you guys have never had pupusas, this is like a, a tortilla that they bake with stuff inside of it. So let's see what this has inside. That one, unfortunately, was very disappointing. It doesn't have anything inside. Oh, there's a little bit of cheese there. Oh, this looks like packed. Let's read the review on this place. That was such a disappointment. I ordered the, the pupusa combo, which is this right here. The fish was terrible, but the pupusas made up for it. So the pupusas actually were pretty good. I'm actually getting the opposite. Maybe I'm just eating the wrong pupusa. Let me pass that one. Oh gosh, it's coming out of my mouth. Let's put it inside the milk. Mmm, oh yeah, that's the good stuff. Let's open up some cabbage here too. At one time it was fresh. So let me just present that to myself. Glad I did that for me. Mm. Cabbage has been sitting out. The cabbage has gone bad. It's not preserved at all. I'm gonna give this restaurant two out of five stars. It should not be serving this stuff like this. What happened to the soy sauce? You, oh, you spilled it everywhere. I didn't spill it. It probably came spilled. Mmm. Really mm -hmm. uh -huh. Are we doing dinner or what's happening? Switch places. Oh, so we just switch seats? Uh, good. Someone spilled soy sauce here and I do not want oh, to so I anymore. have to deal with that? <laughs> yeah, have with fun, Daniel. Your mess. Right. For this next challenge, you guys are swapping. What do you mean? I have nobody to swap with here. Rebecca's not here. You're gonna be eating rich food and they're gonna be eating the food. No way! I get to eat rich food? Okay, you know what? I didn't mind doing the one star and it was good to kind of, you know, like get a taste of humble pie even though they didn't serve pie on the one star reviews. Maybe I'll get some pie here for dinner. I'm gonna switch with Daniel and Maddie right now. They have no idea. Plus, I have a secret for them. They're not gonna be able to survive this. 
What's up, guys? Ew! What are you doing? Yeah. Just like that. You guys read the challenge card, right? Yeah, we already yeah. switched places. Now get out of here, you broke person. I was person. here. No, either. we're switching places. You guys are now broken. I'm super rich. <gasps> what? That's yes, right. right. Good luck buying off the one star menu. It's not easy, but I did it. Fine. I'm taking my cape with me. Enjoy your cape. I will. Keeping this up here too. I can't wait to eat the good life right now. I've been, you know, honestly, kind of was pretty good down there. I only had one stars, but now I'm super giga rich. Let's eat some food. No way, free soy sauce. I could have used that with the fish. Oh my god. What? I cannot believe that we have to be broke now. Look at this place. Wait, where's the table? Where's, where's the plate? The, where's the chairs? Silverware, what do we eat with? Our hand? You have to be kidding me. Are we supposed to sit on the floor? Ugh, you know what? I'm starving now, so I guess we have to order. You're well, starving? One. We just Star ate a bunch of food. Well, it wasn't that great, Daniel. Oh yeah, you barely are picking at your food because you thought it was not so good. All right, what are you see. ordering? Well, we can only order from one star restaurants, and there's a place that has pasta. That doesn't look like pasta, doesn't but yeah. Look like pasta. Yeah, you can order it. Here comes our one star meal. Where are we sitting? Why are we by a garbage can? Oh, that's the smell. Oh my gosh, the smells up here are amazing. It smells so good. I'll be honest, the food downstairs was not as bad as I thought it was gonna be, only eating one star foods for 24 hours. Super tough, but now I gotta see what five stars taste like. Let's open up this menu. No. Steak and lobster, yes. Every single review on this, this restaurant is five stars. If steak and lobster, mashed potatoes, Brussels sprouts, I'm gonna order it right now. This will be here shortly. Whew, now I just gotta kinda relax up here in a non-dirty environment. I wonder how they're doing downstairs. <sighs> okay, we might be broke, but at least we do not have to pay for this. That's true. That would be the worst yeah. waste of money ever. Is it? There's a spunk coming in from that trash can over there. It almost smells like a row up. Oh. oh god, it's probably the food that the broke people have to eat and we're gonna have to eat that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I just wanna have my rich food back. Oh, here comes the food. Is this edible? You shouldn't have got some pasta with that oil that you ordered. No nope. Oh, it's splattered on you. Ew, and it's like moldy chicken. What did you get? I don't know. Okay. I didn't know that you could just order a pile of cheese. The next challenge is you guys have to feed each other with chopsticks. The food has arrived. I don't know what side to go with first. I think they're both full. Let's go with this side first. Oh, sweet mother pearl. Lobster, mashed potatoes. I feel like I'm deep in the East Coast right now. What's over here? Oh, I can't even look at it. It smells so good. Okay, I'll look at it. Woo, pretty good. No time to waste. Have you ever had a lobster? I have, and this is how I like to eat my lobster. Mm, right off the shell. It requires no work and just get in there. I feel like a full man right now. These aren't even like giga rich chopsticks. You have to break them apart yourself. Where's the gold? On the chopsticks. Thought that I ordered bread as well. How? I am not eating floor bread. Mm. I miss being rich. This is the challenge, okay? So we gotta do it. We were giga rich for a while, but look, look, this looks pretty good. Look. Yo, look at it. It's so chunky. Usually it's gooey. I'm so jealous. I wonder how Matt's doing upstairs being rich. He probably didn't even order that much. Sure. Probably aren't one old plate of food, and it's not even that good here. So you gotta eat it. Do you want the meat? No. Or do you want the I whatever that color it. is? I will. I will. No. That's a different color. That's it's kind of purple. Color. Do you want to try it? Not really. Well, I'll give you green then. You got the green part. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Oh, That's that doesn't even taste like good. food. It tastes like rubber. It looks like rubber. Two different types of potatoes. Oh my gosh. This is Fleming, just so you guys know. It's one of the best steak places here in Los Angeles. They have nothing but five star reviews. Oh my gosh. These are their signature potatoes. And they are so fire right now. They taste good when it hits my mouth and it goes all the way down. I'm gonna give this meal right here five out of five stars. Lobster. Mm, wow, this is a six ounce filet mignon. This is the biggest, juiciest bite that I've ever taken. This is how you do it right here. Five out of five. I don't know if you saw it earlier, but there's a big surprise for the people downstairs right now. Let's go and tell them what actually is happening. You just want some pasta? That's a lot. <laughs> okay, well you know what, I can't eat I didn't even get any of this weird chicken that you ordered. I'll give you it in your next bite. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, that's a lot of oil. Oh my god. I don't know what kind of oil that is. It's not <laughs> butter. It's not olive. It's not vegetable. Is it canola oil? Ew, you're eating the floor bread? Oh my god, I can't look at that. It's not bad. This restaurant is a joke I ordered through Postmates. I wish I had looked at Yelp before ordering. First off, pasta tasted okay, but it was all oil, which is what happens when you reheat Alfredo instead of making it. Mm. However, the salad came with onions, green pepper, and mushrooms. Hey guys. Oh, this looks good. No, it doesn't. That's the best meal I've seen downstairs all day. What were you eating? I had terrible food that was all one star rated. Tell me that you didn't get like a big expensive meal up there. No, I just had um, steak and lobster and lobster mashed potatoes. What? And then potatoes are gratin. It's a lot and of lobster. And then I ate it off camera, but I also had Brussels sprouts and dessert too. It's pretty good. This looks pretty good. Nice job, guys. Why is the bread on the floor? It was thrown to us. Oh, it happened all day. Seems like you guys racked up quite the bill upstairs. But luckily, <laughs> we don't have to pay for it. It's all you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Speaking about that, let's swap back our credit cards, okay? Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Have this? Mm -hmm. Okay. 
here. I got mine right here. Wait, you have actually threw a twist in here. You guys paid for your own meals. So hopefully you guys didn't spend too much. Didn't go too extravagant up there. I spent two hundred dollars on breakfast. Why would you spend two hundred dollars on breakfast? Who because does that? I thought you were paying for it. Maddie. I used all the money in my bank account. You probably overdrawn too. Oh, oh my god. Not again. Great. All right, well if you guys want us to do another food challenge, please make sure to watch this video right over here and subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. And why don't we just finish up this pasta here to throw this out, okay? Ooh, Maddie, I'll help erase your debt if you just drink all the oil. No way. Ah!